Hey guys, this is Len the Nintendo with another review right here. This game is so sick, it'll make you vomit more than a sorority girl at a frat party. This game is so hard to figure out, I could probably figure out how to solve the recession before I figure out this piece of shit. Steven Seagal is the final option. Are you serious? What company decided to go after an actor whose movies go straight to Netflix? And put him in a motherfucking game. They don't want Matt Damon. They don't want Leonardo DiCaprio. But they want to go after a D-list actor that's not even in movies anymore. This makes me want to just... I can't even explain. Let's just get into this game and show you how bad this thing is. Oh, look at this map. I'm trying to make it all Mission Impossible-like. We're going to skip all this. Target 1. Stage 1. Underground storage area. What is this? What? I'm, I'm fighting maintenance workers as we speak. Look at John. What? What is this? This guy looks like John Travolta in Greece. Look. <laughs> you, let's pause this. Look at his jacket. Look at his ponytail and the grease in his hair and those jeans. I feel like we're fighting in front of a diner or something. Look at this spin he does. He looks like Michael Jackson. Oh my gosh, look, look how does look how he walks. What? He looks like he just took a shit in his pants. I can't believe this. Okay, let's see here. What do we have to do? Oh, I got hit. What? What did he do right there? Okay, let's walk up here. Okay, there's a doctor. Hello, doctor. The doctor is attacking me. What? <laughs> the doctor is. I have to. I have to fight doctors. And maintenance people who are doing nothing but walking around and just doing what they have to do. Yes, get out of my way, doctor. I know you went to school and got a PhD and you're just chilling, but I'm going to have to attack you because I'm Steven Seagal. Look at this. Wh where am I? What is the goal of this game? I'm still trying to figure this out. Oh, whoa, I can throw knives. Let's try to jump. Wow. Ugh. All right. Ugh. Look at this. Okay. And every time I throw a knife, you see that? I go backwards. Like he does the moonwalk. <laughs> just beat it. Okay, anyways. First of all, let me just pause the game. What man has that many knives readily available on his person at one time? I mean, who walks down the street like, hey, you know what I have? A knife. You want a knife? I have another one. You want to have some target practice? Let's go to the bar. Throw darts. I'm a pro. How many knives does he have? Oh my god. I don't even know what to do about this game. Let's just talk about these graphics. First of all, these graphics make Pit Fighter on Super Nintendo look like some glorious Michelangelo artwork. Okay, get out of my way, construction worker. Go fix an elevator or something. I love the way he walks. Why are his hands doing this weird formation? Okay, let's just get away from these doctor guys. Okay, I guess I'm gonna have to beat the doctor again who went to Stanford Law, I mean medical school, and got his, you know, doctorate. Look how Steven Seagal jumps. Did you did you see that? Did you see that noise? Wow, look at this. Forget the jump, I could just start right here. Wow. Did what the hell just happened there? I thought we were playing Steven Seagal as the final option. I did not know we are playing Star Trek Deep Fucking Space 9. Let's continue. So, if you hit the Y button, you have a chop and a little punch. And if you hit the, the B button, you have a kick. Huh, huh. Looks like Michael Jackson. Let's, let's kick the doctor. Hey, that's what you get for going to school all your life. That's what you get for not paying your loans. Okay, let's jump over this gap. This is what you guys get for not going to school and becoming maintenance workers. You have to deal with Steven Seagal. That's right. My goodness gracious. This game is worse than the ending in the movie Joyride with Paul Walker. Look at this. What am I doing? Okay, let's turn this off. What happens when I go down this wall? Yeah. All right, is Look at this. Look at this. The game doesn't even work. That's it. That's the end of the game. This is the most unfinished game I've ever seen. This game is more unfinished than the vegetable on a six-year-old's plate at the dinner table. Look at this, that's it. That's it. I'm doing my Michael Jackson turns. Okay, you know what? 
I have nothing else to say about this game. I mean, instead of making a game with Steven Seagal called The Final Option, we might as well just make a movie with Wesley Snipes called Wesley Snipes in The Final Notice. And it could be a game where there's a map and seven different places that Wesley Snipes could be and the whole goal is you're the IRS and you have to find him and you have to hand him his final notice to pay his taxes or you'll throw his ass in motherfucking jail. And if you catch him, the award is if you catch him faster than all the other players online, maybe he can watch Blade while he's in prison. Look at this, I just hit another doctor, what is this? I guess he's mad, he doesn't have any like healthcare, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Look at me, let me let me go beat one more doctor before I get out of here. Get out of here, maintenance guy, you're not worth my time. Oh, I'm starting from the beginning. You know what? I'm done with this game. I'm done looking for the doctors. I'm done finding these maintenance dudes. And that's all I have to say. Thank you, everybody.